Steph's Got It, and I'm Steph's Got It, and this is Marty, and today we have for you another unboxing. Today is Christmas Eve, and our Misfit box just arrived, so we thought we'd share it with you. If you are new to the channel, welcome to the channel. If you're a regular, thanks for watching. We appreciate you so much, and uh, we're going to go ahead and see what we got. We got the cooler right here to put it in because after this I'm going to watch Christmas movies <laughs> because we're late getting started this year. All right, so Marty's got it open and on earth? right off the bat we've got a jar of something. Oh, okay. Mom's spaghetti sauce? Mom's spaghetti sauce. I don't remember ordering that, but okay. Whole garlic and fresh basil. So, mm, we've got for the ingredients to, um, tomatoes, which is tomato, salt, calcium chloride, and citric acid. Fresh garlic, uh, then we have fresh garlic, extra virgin olive oil, basil, sea salt, lemon juice, black pepper, citric acid, and vitamin E. And that's it. So, it's pretty natural. And as usual, they did pack something to keep everything cold. Ice pack, and it still has a piece of ice in it. It's pretty cold outside. I mean, if we had left it on the porch all night, it would have been fine. <laughs> and of course, you know I order these every time. My plantain, tortellini. So I ordered two of those. These are from the pantry. I have to pay extra pay for those. Swaffle and caramel. I, a biscuit of some kind. It's a swaffle. It's, um... Here, I'll open it for you. We've got dark chocolate covered one. And then this is just caramel because I love because I love caramel. So it looks like there. It looks like that. That's it. And it's really, as you can see, it's really thin, but it's tasty. And I like them. I haven't had the caramel, so I wanted to try it. This is again from the pantry. It's gluten free gluten-free flour blend, organic rice flour, organic potato starch, organic tapioca flour, cannot speak, tapioca flour. Then it has organic palm fruit oil, organic rice syrup, organic cane syrup, organic everything, okay? <laughs> Liquid whole eggs, butter, molasses, sea salt, uh, xanthan gum, <laughs> cinnamon, pure vanilla extract, Sunflower, lecithin, and baking soda, and organic nutmeg. Contains milk and eggs. Again, all organic. Butternut squash. Spaghetti squash. We always, those are always good to get. Another butternut squash. Oh, look at the size of that baby. It's a zucchini. This is the largest zucchini we have ever gotten. Oh no. And then there's this one, which is broken open. So, still looks pretty good. So, I might just cut off the open parts and still. Whoa! Yes. Look at that. Three huge ones. Wow. <laughs> we usually get tiny ones. Um. We'll probably do this our same way. I may try something new, especially with this one because it's already open. So I may slice it tonight and we'll do something with it. Not sure. But we have been another spaghetti squash. Good grief. A butternut. I'm sorry. Another butternut squash. Awesome. Um, red cabbage. I want to make cabbage steaks. If you don't know what those are, let me know. and I'll, it's, It takes like all of five minutes to make them. So... Mangoes, I have not had this variety. I remember ordering these. I think these are, it doesn't say on here, Kent. I haven't had that variety, so I figured I'd give it a shot. Actually, they look a lot like the ones in Walmart, so not sure. But anyway, they're not ripe yet. Two of those. Another one of those. Another zucchini. Not as big, but really fat. I mean, I can't get my hand, fingers around it. And I have big hands for a woman, so. Da, 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 da. <laughs> I don't know. 
A daikon radish? I remember the thing saying daikon radish. Well, I'm not really sure. I'm gonna have to look this one up. Lisa, help. <laughs> She's my go-to. <laughs> what is this one? Oh, I'll check the list too. Maybe there'll be some, maybe there'll be a picture. They've, they've started putting pictures by everything for those people like us who don't know what yeah. all these nice vegetables are. Um, purple top turnips. These are nice big ones too. So that's nice. And this, if I'm not mistaken, is a watermelon radish. Please tell me there's more than one. No. You're kidding. No. No. I think I, I think I paid for these too. I think I got these out of the pantry. We shall see. I'm gonna have to go check my order. It's just that one. Um, hmm. Or maybe it's a very early purple top turnip. I guess it could be. It could be a purple mm -hmm. top turnip. That's really. Let's hope that's what it is because I hope I would get more than one. Some radish. assembly required on one of those. <laughs> Some assembly required. Uh, my cucumbers. As he's talking about this one that's split. It's also very gushy down there. So I'm going to eat this one tonight. <laughs> Cut the ends off and have a snack with that one. Put that right there on the couch. Beef steak tomatoes? Beef steak tomatoes. There are two nice beef steak tomatoes. And that one, two in this one, a little smaller, ooh, and a little riper. Like these are really ripe. <laughs> like and need to be used immediately ripe. These are soft. Yeah, these feel like they Strangely. need to be eaten like immediately. They are, they're Mandarin. They're pretty big. They're bigger than the Mandarins I got last time. Mandarin oranges. But they look like, like the peel is just peeled off of the skin. So, what is that? Oh, these are red, red Bartlett pear. pears. So, are they Bartlett or du jour? It says red pear on there. Right? Just says red pear. It doesn't say Bartlett. It just says red. And they're a lot redder than the Bartlett's I got last time. So, maybe they're just red pears. I enjoyed the red Bartlett pears. Another cucumber. So, I'm hoping to enjoy these. The Bartlett's are my favorite. This is... <laughs> salad in a can. <laughs> yes. Okay. Or in a cup. As I meant to say, salad in a cup. It's a little jewel. It's a lettuce jewel. <laughs> it's enough for one person. <laughs> so, um, yeah, maybe we'll make a sandwich and we'll put a couple of leaves on a sandwich because yeah. that's all you can do with that. I ordered these from the pantry. They are Chase Pecan Hats because I love pecans. I just don't love always paying that price for them. So... Um, ingredients, nothing but pecans. So awesome. So this is my Christmas present to me. <laughs> I bought some pecans. I love them. Absolutely love them. Boy, I'm on. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> I am loving two things. Uh, garlic and these, um, these, um, green onions or chives, whatever you want to call them. Green onions, I think. I love these, cooking with these and putting them in everything. So I can't remember if that was in the box or if I ordered it. I'm not sure. I ordered these. As I said, I am so hooked on fresh garlic now. I never reach for my jar stuff. And I order these every time because in the pantry, they're only 49 cents. So I have a couple of them. We'll put those here so they don't get wet. And then this. <laughs> we tried to be fancy smancy <laughs> for New Year's night and we ordered some rolling black caviar. Whole grain. Oh yeah, whole grain uh, why would lumpfish. You, that's really weird. Why would whole grain, why would grain lumpfish. fish have to do with this I caviar? have no idea. We've never had caviar, by the way. No, we've never had caviar, <laughs> so we figured they had it in the pantry and um it's at the pantry price, reduced price, so we figured we'd give it a shot. 
uh, Marty wasn't really interested, but I said, well, if we're going to try it some point in our life, well, this is the perfect price point to right, try it. Right. So this is, it isn't your thousand dollar can. Okay. Don't get me wrong. We're not that bougie, but, um, it has pork ingredients. Um, lump fish roe, salt, water. Oh my goodness. I don't know what that is. You know what that is? Tragagants. No, I do. Tragagants. I don't know. Anyway. Tragagant gum, sodium benzo benzoate. It's a preservative. Citric acid. Red number three. Ew. Red dye. Ew. <laughs> Blue dye, yellow dye, contains lump fish. If I had known it was going to be full of dye, I wouldn't have ordered it. It's, well, red dye. I mean, no dye is good for you, but the red dye is the worst. So anyway, we're going to try to be fancy smancy for New Year's Eve and have some caviar. So <laughs> black caviar. It had black and red, and we went with the black. Um, this is... Raw honey, and it is uh, lemon plus lemon and ginger. So let's see. The ingredients list is where? Ingredients: raw honey, ginger, lemon. Just what the title said. Awesome. Nothing extra added in here. It's vegetarian, paleo, and gluten free. So I am interested to try this. Never heated and no sugar added. So we're gonna try. I'm looking forward honey. to trying this in my herbal tea. Um, hibiscus flower, you know that kind of stuff. Mm. All right, so that should be good. Oh, it says you can also spread it on your toast or indulge in a guilt-free straight from the jar. So who knows? If you need a quick boot. Oh. If you need a quick boost of energy, get yourself a tablespoon of honey and just eat it. Quick for energy first. I saw these. I figured we'd give them a shot. They were in the pantry. So you have um, Sonoma Creamery. And this one is, it's a crisp bar. A little bar. It's a very small bar feels like. Maybe two or three in here. But this one is um, cheese crisper bar, and this one is Parmesan cheese, and this one is bacon and cheddar cheese. They're all cheese. Something just moved on the camera. I don't know what it was. Okay. Um, so if, there's a picture. We can see that. The bacon cheddar looks really good. See that picture? That looks really good. So, again, you get them at the pantry price. So, figure you give it a shot. That's all. Is it? All right, folks. That's all we have. Thank you so much for watching. Have a very Merry Christmas. Be safe out there. Do all you can to protect yourself and your loved ones. Anything else? All right, hun. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you like this video. If you like the content on this channel, please feel free to click the little subscribe button down below. And while you're at it, click that little notification bell so that you can be notified anytime that I or we yeah. <laughs> upload a video to this channel. Thank you for your love and support and have an amazing day. With that being said, hun, remember, if you are having a good day, help someone else have a good day. It's those small and simple things in life that make life worth living. Love and shimmy stays. Merry Christmas.